In today's rapidly changing work environment, it is increasingly important to provide a dedicated pathway for routing all electrical, communication, and data cables within a building. Cablo Fill Tray creates a perfect pathway for every cable type, promotes continuous cable management, and facilitates changes. Because Cablo Fill Tray is easily adaptable, the installer can make field modifications to adjust for unplanned changes that occur during construction. These modifications are created with standard straight sections of tray that are formed on the job site. It is this adaptability that makes designing and specifying the Cablo Fill Cable Management System quick and easy. The designer can focus on critical planning issues like growth and expansion, creating perfect pathways that are future-proof. We offer an AutoCAD add-on and CabloFill Visio design software to help reduce your design time. Please take advantage of these tools on your next project. Before you begin the design process, there are several critical questions you'll need to answer to be sure that your installation is successful and cost-effective. You can specify the size of tray needed based on the number and size of cables in a run by using the Cablo Fill Load Table. Start your planning process from the point of origin, which is usually the communications closet or power distribution panel. Select the size and quantity of cables in each run. The software can calculate more than one type of cable to be used in each run. The load table will then display several sizes of tray for you to choose from and the span allowed between supports. Think about the future of the installation. How much growth should be planned into the system for future use or new technologies? At a minimum, the spare or blank breaker locations and spare equipment slots should be used to determine additional capacity. Planning ahead is the most important aspect of the design process, since the primary purpose of a good cable management design is to allow for moves, adds, and changes that can be executed quickly and efficiently. Poor cable management planning can create unforeseen expenses later when replacing existing cables or adding cables to existing pathways. What tray finish should you specify? Is it for interior or exterior use? Our standard electro-zinc trays work for most interior applications. Use hot-dipped galvanized tray for general exterior applications. Is the environment corrosive or have a special purpose? Chemical plants, food processing, or clean rooms are good examples of environments where our 304L stainless steel tray should be specified. 316L should be specified for installation near marine environments. Aesthetic considerations. Cablofill offers painted trays in a variety of colors. A black tray finish gives an installation a contemporary look and is great in a communication closet or in a warehouse rehab with wooden ceiling. A white finish gives data centers a clean, modern look. Also, you can color code trays based on purpose. What support methods will you need? Will trays be suspended from the ceiling or structural beams, attached to walls, or placed in a raised floor? Cablofill has supports specifically designed for every application. Now that you've determined which tray size and finish is needed, you can get a fair estimate of the project by using free design tools from Cablofill. If the plans are in AutoCAD, use our Cablofill AutoCAD add-on as an overlay of the existing cable pathway. It will estimate the total footage of tray needed for your installation. You can download the Cablofill AutoCAD add-on at www.cablofill.com. Just click on the software and specification link. Now that you have calculated the total footage of tray needed, you should have all of the data you need to estimate your project. If you are required to supply detailed shop drawings, we have made it easy for you. Use our best practices web portal. You can find it on our website. It is filled with design drawings and installation ideas that will help you engineer the most efficient cable pathway for the project. If at any time during the design phase you need assistance with your plan, you can contact Cablofill by phone or through the Cablofill website. We are ready to provide you with fast service to make your job easy. Once your design is completed, use Submittal Builder to create your submittal for review. Go to our website to create a complete PDF submittal that includes cut sheets. For printed plans, use the Cablofill Takeoff Assistant Worksheet. This form will help you calculate all tray sizes and total footage of tray needed. It will also calculate the number of splices and supports you will need. To begin, enter the number of T's, elbows and other transitions. Next, enter total lengths of each tray size needed. 
Now select the support method to be used and enter the total number of supports required. For quick reference, the back side of this sheet contains information on the supports and splices, including the correct quantities to be used and the model numbers. Next, based on total footage of tray, calculate the total number of splices needed. At the bottom of the worksheet, determine the total number of EZT90s you will need by totaling the number of transitions you have listed above. Finally, calculate the total footage for each tray size and enter it at the bottom of the form. You have now completed a bill of material. Cablofill is ready to help you with preparing a bill of material and can provide you with a quotation. All it takes is a phone call or you can contact us through our website.